Nazis at the Center of the Earth is a direct-to-video sci-fi film produced by The Asylum that stars Dominique Swain and Jake Busey. It was released on April 24, 2012 on Blu-ray disc and DVD. The United Kingdom release was called Bloodstorm. The Lexicon des Internationalen Films considers the film a rip-off mockbuster aimed at exploiting the hype surrounding the film Iron Sky. Topic. Plot On May 10, 1945, in a secret airport near Würzburg, Germany, Nazi scientist Dr. Joseph Mengele, along with fellow doctors and soldiers, prepare to depart into an unknown location with a mysterious package in their possession. They are soon ambushed by the Allied forces, but successfully escape. In present day, a group of researchers in Antarctica, Dr. Paige Morgan among them, are abducted by a platoon of gas-masked soldiers wearing swastika armbands and dragged into a hidden environment in the center of the Earth. There, they discover that Dr. Joseph Mengele and a group of surviving Nazi soldiers are plotting an invasion of Earth to create a Fourth Reich. Topic. Cast. Dominique Swain as Dr. Paige Morgan Jake Busey as Adrian Riestad Joshua Michael Allen as Lucas Moss Christopher Carl Johnson as Dr. Joseph Mengele Leelon Bowden as May Yun Trevor Kuhn as Brian Moak Adam Birch as Mark Maynard Marlene Ochner as Siege Logazin Maria Pallas as Angela Magliarosa Andre Tenerelli as Aaron Blackman, Abdurrahim Halimia as Rahul Jumani Michael Schwab as Adolf Hitler Topic. Production Lawson received the directorial assignment after reading the script and pitching himself as director in the fall of 2011. The film took less than four months to make. On Asylum, Lawson said, They are a low-budget film studio. I knew pretty much going in that this was going to be a B-movie. We had a 12-day shoot and a budget well south of $200,000. The entire movie was storyboarded by the director shot for shot before production began in November 2011. Locations for the film included Willow Studios in Los Angeles underground in the Nazi bunker and Niflheim Station, Blue Cloud Ranch in Santa Clarita opening war night scenes and the underground cavern, and the Asylum Studios hallways, labs, medical rooms, repelling scenes and green screen virtual sets. The film features one of the highest visual effects shot counts in an Asylum film, 379, and the effects were completed in just four weeks. In his commentary, director Joseph J. Lawson cites as his visual influences Steven Spielberg, Peter Jackson, Sam Raimi, John Carpenter, John Landis, David Lean, J.J. Abrams and Robert Rodriguez. Topic. Reception Critical and audience reaction to the film has been mixed with everything from absolute garbage to the Citizen Kane of Asylum films. <laughs>